We're going to talk about heat pumps and batteries. First, if you could say your name and where you're from. I'm Andy Bauer and I live in Portland, Connecticut. And I understand you use heat pumps and batteries and recommend it for a number of reasons. Yeah, we've got an all electric house. Uh, it's powered by solar and uh, we just recently had three 10 kilowatt uh, batteries installed. And uh, the original impetus for me was, you know, battery backup in case of a power outage. But the more the batteries operate, the more I was able to find out the batteries, we have an arrangement with the utilities so that the utilities will draw from the batteries during peak demand. It's called a dispatch event. It's like high heat and humidity in the middle of the summer. Um, I win because I've got, you know, emergency backup. But everybody else, even if you don't have batteries, every other ratepayer wins because what my batteries are doing is they are shaving off peak demand when the energy is most expensive. I mean, just frightfully expensive. And that cost is spread over all of the ratepayers of Connecticut. So you've got my house, if you had like 100,000 houses in Connecticut with battery backup, that peak demand would come up, come down. And the, the, the amazing statistic is if you want it, to make that peak demand go up by just 1%, if we have to power all of Connecticut, that's, 8% of the total cost, which is insane. So if everybody, you know, the more battery backup we have, uh, not only those individual users gain like I just did, but also everybody in Connecticut pays a little bit less for their electricity throughout Connecticut. Thank you.